In today's video, I will teach you how to create a line art from a photo in PhotoP. Let's get started. First, go to PhotoP, then click File, then Open to import the photo that you want to convert into a line art. Now we're going to convert the photo to black and white. Start by going to Image, Adjustments, then black and white to convert the photo to grayscale. Then adjust the sliders if needed to get the desired contrast. Alternatively, you can go to Image, Adjustment, then desaturate to remove the color. Now we're going to increase the contrast and adjust levels. Start by going to Image, Adjustments, then Levels to open the Levels dialog. Then adjust the input levels to increase the contrast, making the dark areas darker and the light areas darker. This step helps in defining the edges more clearly. Now we're going to create a new layer for the line art. To do this, go to Layer, New, then Layer to create a new layer. Then name it Line Art or something similar. And if you want to keep the photo visible as a reference, Set the new layer's blending mode to overlay or multiply. Then adjust the opacity if needed. Now we're going to trace the photo to create line art. Choose the brush tool from the toolbar, then select a hard round brush from the brush settings and set the color to black or another color for your lines. In the new layer, manually trace over the major lines and edges of the photo. This can be done freehand or with a pen tool for more precise lines. And to refine and clean up the line art, you can start by erasing unwanted lines. Use the eraser tool to clean up any unnecessary lines or areas that you don't want in your final line art. And if needed, adjust the thickness of your lines by changing the brush size or by using the stroke path option in the paths panel. You can adjust the opacity of the line art layer, add additional details, or make other changes as needed. And once you're satisfied, go to File, then Export As, then choose the desired format like PNG for transparency or JPEG for a flattened image. Then click Save to download the final line art. And you're done! If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.